Let's find the oxidation number of carbon in C2H4. The oxidation number of hydrogen is going to be either plus one or minus one. If hydrogen is bonded to a metal, its oxidation number is minus one, a non-metal, plus one. Carbon is a non-metal. The oxidation number of hydrogen is plus one. The oxidation number of carbon is unknown. Since the net charge on this molecule is zero, the oxidation numbers must sum to zero. There's two carbon atoms. There's four hydrogen atoms. Solving for X, minus two. Checking the oxidation number chart for carbon, we don't see an oxidation number of minus two. However, remember this chart is just a guide. In other situations, because hydrogen can only have an oxidation number of plus one or minus one, we could solve for X when the hydrogen oxidation oxidation number is equal to minus one and compare that to the oxidation number chart. For example, if hydrogen was bonded to a metalloid, that's what we would do. However, one of the primary rules is that if hydrogen is bonded to a non-metal, it will take on the plus one oxidation number. So this needs to stay at plus one. Therefore, the oxidation number on the carbon must equal minus two.